This is the story of a journey through Namibia, visiting three beautiful lodges and five even more amazing game parks, among them Sossus Vlei. It is a tough journey through a desert where you encounter nothing and no one en route. This is why we have come to Namibia. Almost half the country is made up of nature reserves. The natural environment and all the wild animals are protected under the country's unique constitution. The lodges such as Wolverdunce in the Namib Rand Nature Reserve are situated in very remote areas. And the easiest way to reach them is by Cessna an exhilarating flight that gives you a spectacular view over the desert. This is Damaraland in the north. Here you can stay at the Damaraland camp, a luxury eco-lodge run by the local people. A leasing agreement with the Torah Conservancy means the lodge is allowed to be situated on its land in return for work opportunities for the local people. And it is the Torah inhabitants who manage the conservation activities, so everyone benefits. The friendly people of the Torah Conservancy speak English just as easily as their renowned Khoisan click language. They know that the tourists come to experience their unspoiled desert landscape. In Damaraland, you can go on fantastic safaris. To the Huab River, for example, home to the rare desert elephant. These animals have totally adjusted to living in the desert. They are smaller than normal elephants and feed on the leaves and fruits of the acacia tree. The inhabitants of the Torah Conservancy live just a couple of kilometers away in the middle of the nature reserve. This is one of the few places in Africa where people and wild animals can live together in harmony. Further to the east lies Ongava, a spectacular private nature reserve. Ongava is situated near the famous Etosha National Park. You can see both black and white rhinoceros here, and lions. A team of rangers monitors the animals round the clock to keep poachers at bay. If you drive on towards the south, you can visit Okanjima, this lodge works closely with the Africat Foundation. It is specialized in rescuing and looking after cheetahs and leopards. This extensive reserve offers a home to these young animals and helps prepare them for a return to the wild. In the lodges and parks visited on this trip, everything revolves around education and nature conservation. This is thanks to Namibia's unique constitution which protects all its wild animals. It is a highly successful approach, both for the future of the country's natural environment and for its people. Take a closer look at the lodges and nature reserves in the longer version of this film, or better still, travel to this amazing African country yourself. Meet the people and enjoy the dramatic expansive scenery. It is also possible to rent a car yourself to travel to these game parks. <laughs>